Okay, so there's there's allegations that you hired police officers Sammy Martin, David Mack, and Rafael Perez. Do you know Sammy Martin? No. Do you know David Mack? No. Have you ever met Rafael Perez? No. Okay, so how are these three cops? We know for a fact Rafael Perez and David Mack were corrupt because they got convicted. We don't know a lot about Sammy Martin, but how are these three cops, LAPD, linked to you? I told you. Right way. By Mario Hammond. And, and then Kevin Hackey, you know, said, uh, I think I saw them around Death Row. People don't know. They just throw out stuff because they want to be rele relevant or, or say something. But the one good thing about it, and the one thing I will ask some people to do, is we know phone, cell phone records is there, is out there. Y'all don't think the FBI... Uh, LAPD and all these people have never pulled up all our phone numbers to see if we ever talked to you. once, not not ten times, twenty times, one time. Have you ever heard any of them? They done told on all of each, each other. Only ones they ain't told on is Raphael ain't told on David Mack. Well, he ain't told on everybody else. Got people with major time and stuff. They have never uttered the name Reggie Wright Jr. Not one of them. Only jailhouse informants reading stuff in the newspaper, knowing me and Shug's relationship, are the only ones that ever bring up the name Reggie Wright Jr. Why, why is that? If I, if I had to say the name Reggie Wright Jr., and I'm about to do seven years, I'm saying if 14 years if I'm David Mack, seven years if I'm Rafael Perez, which I want Reggie? Y'all really want Reggie? I'll give y'all Reggie. Oh, Reggie, a bad motherfucker. Which one is it? I ain't that bad. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so just to be clear, David Mack, Rafael Perez, and Sammy Martin were never on the payroll of Right Way or Death Row. Never, never. My, my payroll have been audited and everything. It was only three, two LAPD cops that worked for me maybe more than once. Three total. One was a Kenneth Sutton. He worked one time at a video shoot. Uh, David Love, he maybe worked at the two or three different video shoots, and then this guy named Rich McCulley, who everybody knew that worked for me. He was uh, out there in the open. He, was a, he eventually made sergeant that had to end up retiring. Now, everybody thinks, and I get this a lot, you know, hey, I used to be a cop. Used, hey, do you know my cousin? Uh, he's a cop. He worked at uh, Pacific Division in LAP. No, I worked at Compton. <laughs> we're eight mile wide city with 200 cops. I worked at Compton PD. That's all I knew was those 200 cops that was at Compton PD. I don't know no shares, you know, a few, maybe five, just because you maybe ran into them here and there, talked to them in the courthouse, you know, sitting in there, or they may came and did, you know, a raid and you needed a system. But if I knew more than 10 shares in my lifetime, before Compton became shares, if I knew more than 10, I would be surprised. If I knew more than five LAPD cops, I would be surprised. Now, is it possible that Suge had relationships with Rafael Perez, David Mack, and Sammy Martin? Thanks for watching StreetTV.net. If you're not subscribed, please hit that button below and click the bell to receive alerts and notifications. Feel free to comment below so you can give us your feedback and be sure to watch the two related episodes to the right. If you want to support this platform or follow us on social media, visit the links in the description. And thanks for watching StreetTV.net.